Good morning, afternoon, evening, whenever you're watching this. So this is Shannon Magania and I'm the Children's Ministries Director. I'm excited to share this week's Bible story with you. It is a great story. You are going to love it. I promise. So it's about some people who Jesus healed. Let's see what happens. I can't wait. Jesus was on his way to Jerusalem when he entered a village. Ten men cried out to him, Jesus, Master, have mercy on us. The men did not come close to Jesus because they had a skin disease called leprosy. Jesus saw them and said, Go and show yourselves to the priest. Jesus wanted the men to follow the law God had given to Moses. The law said, a person who had a skin disease had to go to a priest to be examined when the disease was gone. The priest and the person had to follow certain rules so the person could live a normal life among people again. As they went, the ten men were miraculously healed. One of the men, seeing that he was healed, went back to Jesus. He praised God and fell face down at Jesus' feet, thanking him over and over. This man was a Samaritan. Jesus asked the man, weren't 10 men cleansed? Where are the others? Only this man, a foreigner, had returned to give thanks and praise to God. Jesus told him, get up and go on your way. Your faith has saved you. Jesus healed the 10 men who cried out to him. The one who had faith was saved. When we trust in Jesus by faith, he heals us from something greater than a disease. He saves us from our sins. We can give him thanks and worship him for making us new. So did you count them? How many were there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. You got it right. There were 10. But how many came back to thank him? Only one? Isn't that crazy? Can you believe it? Well, guess what happened to that one? That one was saved by Jesus. Isn't that exciting? I hope that you have come to know Jesus too. So he wants to have a relationship with each one of us and offer us eternal life. I hope that you ask him to be your forever friend today. I want to share the Bible verse for the month. Here it is. It is from Isaiah 53 verses 4 and 5. Surely he took our pain and bore our suffering, yet we considered him punished by God, stricken by him and afflicted. But he was pierced for our transgressions. He was crushed for our iniquities. <clears throat> the punishment that brought us peace was on him, and by his wounds we are healed. Isn't that amazing? By his wounds we are healed. You and me and everybody are healed. Healed from our sin, healed from our shame, healed from what we did yesterday, today, tomorrow. We're healed. Praise God. I'm so excited. So I look forward to seeing you guys soon. I hope you enjoyed that story. It was amazing. This month is going to be amazing with many more stories of different people who Jesus healed. So can't wait to see you next week. Have a great week. God bless you. Bye.